Hey everybody, Man, could you it's me again, weaker? Kale. Here once more playing Tales of Vesperia. Last time we left off, Yuri's got that look of murder in his eyes, and apparently this fucking turtle just wants to throw down. And we see how well that went. Anyway, we were holed up in Halur, and we're just gonna chill there until everybody was ready to go. But Yuri being Yuri apparently doesn't want to wait for everybody else, so we're just gonna go it alone. I'm taking you down. Because he's a giant dingus. But at least I got good boy Repeat keeping an eye on me. Man's best friend indeed. Anyway. Suppose I'll have to diet and hold first since it's on the way. Oh, that looks good. Oh yeah, that, uh... Why can't I go in here? Maybe I need to go through the forest? I mean, it is one way through, I suppose. Kind of an odd choice, but I'll take it. Maybe we don't want to tip them off. Maybe that's the thing. Ooh, and while I'm here, I can check to see if I can break through bushes now. A man can dream. We're done. Got my way. You're all a bunch of weaklings. Uh, which way was it? Man, could you be any weaker? Well, we're retreading old ground. This is your fault, Yuri. Let's go. If we had the rest of the party, we could probably go through Died and Hold. But no. Mr. Lowell has to do it the hard way. I need fire! upset. After all this time, I still can't get through that damn bush. That bush has confounded me since the beginning. And it continues to do so. Oh, hey, that's... This is where... This is where we first learned something was weird about Estelle. She brought an old Blasty to life because she generates air. I remember when air. Estelle ate that Nia fruit. That was quite a face she made. <sighs> oh, come to think of it, it's been a long time since we've been on our own, huh, pal? I haven't been feeling like myself, even when I'm fighting. It's like I'm tired all of a sudden. You mind keeping an eye out for a while, Repeat? <clears throat> I mean, you were just in a fucking airship crash, man. This guy, I tell ya. Yuri, you... Huh? Idiot! Punch him! Huh? Jeez, you almost took my head off, buddy! What the... What? Carol? You brain-dead piece of crap! You tell him. Hey, hold on a sec! You trying to be some stupid lone wolf or something? Lone wolf? Wait, I... Save the excuses for later. Huh? Huh? <laughs> for now, you can drop dead. Whoa! <laughs> uh... Such excitement. Hey there, sunshine. Still living? Barely. Maybe. <laughs> well, it looks like you're awake now. How nice. Jeez, repeat. What happened to keeping a lookout? He led us right to you. Like oh, oh, who's a good buffer? He's pretty clever, you know. Oh, repeat, you're the best boy. Yeah, he told us if we came this way, we'd see the biggest fool in the world. Do you guys know what's going on? Do you really understand what has to happen after this? You're the one who doesn't understand. Carol. You can't. This is one thing you can't just do on your own, Yuri. What were you trying to prove? How far did you think you'd get without us? Yuri, even if you leave us behind, we're still gonna search the whole world from top to... 
What it boils down to is, it's no fair keeping all the fun and glory to yourself. Would it hurt for you to believe in us a little bit more? We believe in you, Yuri. Yeah, I mean, we're your friends. Friendship! You got me, guys. All right, then. We're all in this together. Until the end. Aye! Right! Good, now stop um, being a big duh. dingus. So let's go do this thing. The way out of the forest is right over there. Y yes, uh, we've been... Yeah, never mind. Oh, This is Rapide's Repeat, redemption arc. He's such a good boy. Such a good boy. I wonder if the world will benefit if Prince Yoder becomes emperor. Who knows? What kind of weak answer is that? I thought you'd be at least a little optimistic. Well, he'll have Flynn around. That should help things a little. But only a little? I'm not so wide-eyed and innocent to think that major change is going to happen overnight. That sounds like you all right. Let's be honest here. Yuri is not a trusting individual when it comes to people in authority. Anyway, let's get the heck out of here. I want to go bash some faces that actually have a little bit of uh, a little bit of fight to them. Also, I missed my dragon friend. Yeah, it really does not look good. God. Probably double check my party lineup too. Do we even have a chance? Get out of my way, doggos. Oh, wait. Oh. They're airsick. Wow. It's amazing what a little extra air will do to the local wildlife. Big. We are brave Vesperia. Smooth sailing. Shut up, Patty. You ruined everything. Even your even your end of battle quotes just seem tacked on. All right, let's see here. Yeah, I think after everything that Rapide just did, he he's earned his spot on the team for now. All right, let's rock and roll. I don't want to hurt these guys. They're just feeling sick. They're not in their right mind. They're just sad. No! <laughs> Damn it, pupper. I suppose I could try. <laughs> The Flynn Brigade? Well, if it isn't the Imperial Knights, I guess they're getting ready to invade the capital. But it looks like they're at a standstill. I wonder if something's wrong. Oh, yeah. Yuri, wouldn't it be great if Flynn came with us? Did you forget that he's leading the Knights? I really doubt there's any way he could come with us. I mean, even having him as, as like, soon as the scouts return, back up, that'd be great. All of the lieutenants. Yuri! Everyone! <laughs> it's that evil look from Sodia. Thank goodness you're alright. Her Highness must still be in Zophius, then. Yeah, for now at least. What are you doing out here? The Royal Guard has taken up their positions ahead. 
We're just waiting on the scouts I sent to observe the enemy forces. Captain, you don't have the time to be speaking with... No need to worry. We don't plan on staying long. You're going to the capital too? Yes. There's something I'd like to discuss alone with you. Do you mind? Captain! It's fine. I'll be back soon. If there are any movements, be sure to notify me. How dare you go speak alone with this vagrant! Let's go. To be fair, she's not wrong. Prince Yoder informed me of what's been going on, about Lady Esteliz's powers, too. If it really comes down to it, you might have to. Hey, the whole reason we're going to the capital is to prevent that from happening. I know that. I'm only talking about the worst case scenario. I've already made my choice. Or have you forgotten? No. I remember. I'm prepared for the worst, but I'm going in the hope that it can be avoided. What are you going to do? I've been thinking about this for a long time now. What is a law? What is a crime? Where is the line between right and wrong? After much consideration, I came to the undeniable conclusion that such a clear distinction cannot be made. Even now, my belief that we all need laws hasn't changed. But, even so, I cannot bring myself to call you evil. That's why I hoped that we could make a world where we wouldn't have to keep repeating the same mistakes. Yet look at what's happening now. Then why not come with us? The capital's full of air, so your knights wouldn't be able to enter. But if you come with us, even if we can't get everyone through, we might be able to manage some of them. Dane Nomos, huh? Honestly, I don't know what's gonna happen from here on out. So you're gonna have to decide for yourself what to do. You only got so many options right now. I... Excuse me, sir. A large group of battle machines has emerged from the enemy lines. The numbers are staggering. Oh, that's good. What? <laughs> Man, he really wants to keep that capital. Oh no! It's the Crab Brigade! Oh, Yuri! We're in big trouble! How could they have been hiding so many of their forces? It looks like we're going to have some difficulty breaking through that. Some? Oh, no, that's gonna be brutal. By the time we get to the capital, we'll already be half dead. It's not like we have to face those things head on. Patty, do you see any way around them? Hmm. There's nothing but enemies anywhere I look. I have a feeling it might be impossible. But we're so close to the capital. They've started to move. They're coming this way. Hey, shouldn't we withdraw back to the hold? All right, Flynn, time to do your thing. Captain. Yuri, are you going to the capital to stop Alexei? And to save her highness? Yeah. Then, no matter how this ends, I believe that what you've decided is the best possible outcome. Flynn. You should go. Thanks, buddy. Knights! An enemy battalion stands before us, and Alexei lies in wait behind them. I won't tell you this will be easy, and I understand if you want to flee. But I want you to remember what it is that we must do. What it is that we're protecting. We're knights. With our swords, we protect the people. I will not force any of you to fight. But if you share the same spirit as I do, then let us fight this battle together! Yeah! That really is amazing! Imperial Knights! Straight ahead! Let's head for the capital. Let's break through the enemy line. I think Flynn's got this part covered. Oh man, there's a scuffle. Look at all that scuffle. That's a scuffle if I ever saw one. <sighs> a double sigh? Knock it off. We have to make up our minds about Estelle. <gasps> from what people who fled from the capital said, it's probably already too late. Stop it! Don't say that! I think Yuri has decided where he stands already. How would you know that? You mean, the reason he tried to go alone was... We have to make up our minds, too. I know what we have to do, but still... 
There is always a better way. And before we go to find that way, let's save the game because I was feeling kind of climactic. Not like fully climactic, but kind of climactic. Oh, yeah, this is... It's hard to believe we're really in the capital. This is so horrible. The plants are all overgrown. It's got to be the air. It's so dense. Too much of this stuff would kill anybody. We'd definitely be in trouble without that sword. Keep day normal yeah, at the ready. Stick close to me. Especially you, old man. Hey, I've been on pins and needles since we got here. Hold my hand, would you? Give me a break. Hold my hand. I'm not letting you... Give it a rest. I'm not going off by myself anymore. Look! Leave me alone, Patty. Monsters got in here. How? The barrier is back up and running fine. They look like they're going crazy. Like the ones we saw back at Cave Mock. Yuri, no, what is it? They're air sick for sure. Huh? Oh, it's nothing. Let's go. We can't keep Estelle waiting. Hmm? The lower quarter's at the bottom of that slope. It's his home. Oh, shh. It's... It looks like it's been overrun by the plants. <sighs> no wonder he's worried. Hey, what's up, old man? I want to hear what you're planning. You know, about Estelle. <sighs> We're all floating in the same boat, right? Care to share? I'm not sure I won't lose my nerve if I start talking about it now. You're just gonna have to bear with me till the time comes. You're prepared to do what's necessary. But you haven't given up hope. That about sums it up. I guess that's your style. But don't try to take it all on by yourself, all right? <laughs> it's weird hearing kind words from you, Raven. <laughs> True enough. He's your friend, even if he is kind of a dick sometimes. Raven's a good guy. This doesn't look good. Get ready for anything. Can I scan them all again, too? <laughs> Go away, Manticora. Man, that opening for the for the brutal strike is not always easy to hit. Get up. That wasn't too bad. Finish that one. Good. I can upgrade her weapon now. Perfect. What's next? Probably this. The capital's like this, and Estelle's power's been released. The world might be done for. Oh, the gloom. Rita, darling, how can you be so gloomy? Okay, first, never call me darling. <laughs> Second, excuse me for not being as optimistic as you. Hey now, old Raven's not without his own worries. Oh, really? Sure, but what's the point of getting all down? We're doing all we can to make this work out, right? You just gotta believe in yourself. Wait. That's basically a Rita trademark, ain't it? Okay, fine, you're right. Oh, how could I let you outsmart me? There now, there's hope for the world yet. As long as our little genius doesn't lose that attitude. Look, a broken clock is right twice a day. Give, give him his occasional victories. Oh, I need, to, I need to scan the bees. I haven't scanned the bees yet. Ow, ow. Damn giant fizz. Sucker punch. Yeah, we're 
Nice shot. Popper! That's a good boy. Alright. I'll just ignore you then. That bird doesn't seem to want to fuck with me. I'm not gonna make a big deal out of it. You're all so bad at conserving your TP. Perfect. Can I upgrade your weapon now? Nope, I could. Yeah. 8 of 1. 771. Already learned that one, though. So, 801 it is. How about anybody else? Hopper? You good? cold and prickly all the time. I mean, I know he's worried about the lower quarter, and we all want to wring Alexei's neck, but still. Oh, I'd say it's all right from time to time. What's all right about it? The fact that he acts like this, knowing the tension it causes, is a sign that he's softened. The old Yuri would never have let us see that he was upset about something. It's hard to stay emotional when your friends analyze you like you weren't even there. <laughs> yeah. Hello, Eggbur. Hey, got him. Keep your eyes on my sword. I, uh, I, uh, you're Yuri. I, I hate to remind you this, but you're wielding an axe. Just saying. Shit, I got a six hit combo now. There's no way we're gonna lose. Nice. Is that right? Uh, combo plus two. Yeah, adds two more regular hits. Okay. Nice. It's pretty baller. I can only assume he's in the palace somewhere. Let's bust through. Damn, it shut up tight. Look up there! I might be able to squeeze through. Nice. You can go through there and open it from the other side. We're counting on you! Why'd you make the old man do it? Hey, we're out of time. Why don't we just blow it open? Just because there's nobody out here doesn't mean nobody's in there. It'd be a pain if we were discovered. The air is all over the city, isn't it? It's gotta be in the castle, too. Alexei must have taken some sort of precautions against that. One would think so, anyway. Oh, Carol did it! He seems like a pretty calculating individual. Got it! Everybody hurry! Good work. Okay, this is it, folks. Lynn entrusted Estelle to you, right? Yeah. He's taken on his own share of burdens, so we can focus on rescuing Estelle. Still, it must be hard for you. Oh, I'll carry you. Who's a good boy? Good. I'm sure we can save Estelle back. <clears throat> I'm glad you're with me, Pupper. 
You give me hope. Yeah, this place seems pretty clear. Huh? There's no air in here. He must have figured out how to use Estelle's power <gasps> to do this. Actually, I can still breathe. It may have been that the outer barrier was to keep the air in. That hunch you had is looking more likely by the minute, old man. We're gonna have company before long. Why is it I'm only ever right about the bad stuff happening? It's an unfortunate capacity of yours. If you only think negatively, only bad stuff's going to happen. So, well said. I'm sure you're right about that. Hmm. I've always thought of myself as an optimist, to be honest. It's not like saying that now's gonna change anything. We gotta br Yeah, those bogus knights who've sided up with the bad guys don't stand a chance. Yeah. I fuck them up. It's too bad in a way. I finally get to see the castle, but not for the reason I was hoping. That's alright, we'll clear it out and then it'll be like a pleasant tour. Let's go, little buddy. All we got is like a low base. That's unnerving. Where am I going? Yeah, actually, I think I remember this place now. I think I was imprisoned around here somewhere. Yeah! Ah, uh, memories. Someone's making toilet gels. Old man? Hey, look, you gotta smuggle in some protection. It's a moon guard. Pretty snazzy, if you ask me. It was in your cell. Nice. It's a pretty solid bow. I'll hook you up with that as soon as we, uh, learn you something. Magic lens. And all these things that I probably could have found well in advance. Wings are spread, a circle of light shall shine above the child of the full moon. I remember that. Hmm. I probably should have been paying more attention when I was here the first time. Hello, sir. Fake knights. side with the bad guys. Feels like the statue back there is going to be important at some point. I'm not entirely sure. I wonder if that stew's still hanging out. Yeah, I could really go for some stew right about now. Hold on. Someone's there. Huh? 
What the hell are you idiots doing here? What the... Yuri? Oh, it's Yuri! Huh? Hanks! Aw. LeBlanc. Dipshits. Did you... Hanks! Everyone! You're all okay! Are you taking care of the lower quarter people? Hey, that's my line! Why are you inside the castle? Yeah, you all too. Yes, well, Sir Flynn ordered me to lead the evacuation of the citizens. However, I realized that the inhabitants of the lower quarter were nowhere to be found. It wasn't part of my orders, but uh, you see... The exit collapsed, and a strange fog covered the ground. We were in quite a fix. Well, thanks to these knights, we escaped the fog and came here. They saved our lives. Oh, thanks, you guys. I am prepared to receive punishment for violating my orders. I say, we will, we take, will the take the same, same punishment. punishment. Punishment? I'm just an old man, boys. Anyway, isn't it the duty of the knights to protect the citizens? You did well. Th this is an honor. Captain Schwa... Uh, Captain Raven. Don't call me Captain. I'm just Raven. Sir, I apologize, Sir Just Raven. <laughs> Sir Just Raven. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like somebody respects you. I never would have believed it. Guess you can't judge a book by its cover. This is great, Yuri. <laughs> I forgot how tough everyone was. What was I worried about? <laughs> I don't know why, Yuri, but you looked happier than I've ever seen you before. Yeah, she's right. Did you see the former Commandant? Sir, no, sir. But we overheard the royal guard outside. Something about the sword stair? Hmm. The sword stair? That really tall thing we got blasted off of. So that means he's still up there. Sounds like smoke and scoundrels both like high play. The problem is only important Shush. people can get to the sword stair. There's some special mechanism. I can take care of locks. Rita can take care of formulas. We can do it. You said it. Damn right. Thanks. All of you should stay here and hide. Teamwork, Let's motherfucker. Go. Got any of that stew lying around? Aww. I had you guys pegged wrong. You're great. All three of you. Will do, buddy. Isn't this great? Now everyone in the lower quarter is safe. Yeah. Now all that's left is crushing Alexei and saving Estelle. You must be so proud that your men are finally doing some actual <laughs> work. I've tried to tell you, I don't have any men. There was a real sparkle in their eyes when they were looking at you, old man. How can someone respected by so many be so cold to his friends? All right, Raven's starting to think he's had about enough of these shenanigans. Got accepted, old man. You're liked. By me and them. Anyway, I think with a realization that Yuri's fears are at an end, or at least, you know, aside from Estelle, we can call today's episode. This is a good note to end on. Hope you're all enjoying yourselves. If you are, please feel free to let me know down below if you like, comment, subscribe. And we'll come back and start trying to figure out the mysteries of this castle in the next episode. Till then, though, you will have yourselves a fabulous day. I'll see you in the next adventure. Later.